Good evening, YouTubers. New Time Travel Jaime 88. I'm back with another video, and it's time once again for another VHS and DVD update for September 5th, 2020. Got a lot of new movies in my collection, so let's get down to business with the 1981 VHS of Davy Crockett and the River Pirates with Fess Parker, Buddy Epson, and Jeff York. The film is from 1956 and is directed by Norman Foster. And this is another Neon Mickey VHS that I got from eBay. And this is a compilation edited into two episodes that was edited into a one film. That is Keel Boat Race and The River Pirates. And I know the awesome VHS and beta collector has this copy as well. 81 minutes, not rated, for sale only, not attended for rental. This is a whip slaying of a motion picture, as my fate might say, Walt Disney at its very best, says Hollywood Reporter. Here's the sticker label, and I know this, the sticker label's old, it's almost fell apart. And it's no print date on this tape, but it's formal rental for movies to go, and it's recorded on a scotch tape. It says, for sale only, not intended for rental. Here's the same thing. I'm going to rewind the tape when I'm done. Finish this video. And this has the Neon Mickey Walt Disney Home Video from 1978. Next up, the 1989 VHS of Dumbo. The film is from 1941. And this is the updated artwork. I also have the 1985 and the 1987 release and the 91 release. 63 minutes, Ray G. A film you will never forget since the New York Times. Got this all from Macari. Here's the sticker label. And it's no print date. And this has the 1984 The Classics Walt Disney Cheesy Black Diamond logo at the beginning. And I'm going to rewind the tape as well when I finish. Next up, the 1999 VHS of 101 Dalmatians, part of the Walt Disney Masterpiece. The film is from 1961. I also have the 1992 Black Diamond VHS and the 2008 Platinum Edition release. It includes a bonus mouse work featurette starring Pluto, Pluto Gets the Paper, the same short that was featured on the 1999 release of The Rescuers. 79 minutes, ready G. Here's the ink label, printed on February 6, 1999. Wow, this tape is printed on my mom's birthday at the time. And I'm going to rewind this tape as well. Next up, the 1999 VHS of Inspector Gadget. This is Inspector Gadget with Matthew Broderick and Rupert Everett. Also starring Jolie Fisher, Michelle Trachtenberg, Andy Dick with D.L. Hughley and Dabney Coleman. The film is from 1999 and is directed by David Callahan. The Greatest Hero Ever Assembled. This is the last film that Walt Disney produced by Caravan Pictures. 78 minutes rated PG. I also have this on DVD. Here's the ink label. The print date, October 16th, 1999. And this has the Youngstown music video at the end and also before that it shows the Inspector Gadget cartoon VHS promo and it's got the other rebates right here okay the next tapes are factory seal VHS first one is the 1998 VHS of South Pacific with Rosiano Ros Brasili Mitzi Gaynor, John Kerr, also starring Way Walston, Juanita Hill. The film is from 1956. 
actually it's 1958, excuse me. It's directed by Joshua Logan. And this is a widescreen series, and it's THX. 1958 film renewed in 1986. Not rated and is 157 minutes. And this does not have the 20th Century Fox logo at all because instead it has the Samuel Golan Company logo at the beginning. I also have the 1990 VHS as well. And next up, the 19... Ne next up, oh, the 1998 DVD release, no, VHS release, excuse me, of the Music Man Special Edition from 1998. With Robert Preston, Shirley Jones, also starring Buddy Hackett, Hermione Gringold. The film is from 1961 and is directed by Morton Da Costa. And this is my fourth Warner Brothers Special Edition tape. The others are Superman the Movie Special Edition, Enter the Dragon, The Outlaw of Josie Wells. And the Ex, I believe The Exorcist. Special edition, I'm not sure, but. I also have the 1991 VHS and the Laserdisc, re Laserdisc release of The Music Man. It's got some special features. Nin 1961 film renewed in 1989. Ray G and his 151 minutes. The extra, so that's all together, brings to 176 minutes. Hmm. And next up, here's some four tapes that are still in factory seal. Start with the 1997 VHS of Superman the Movie with Marlon Brando, Gene Hackman, Christopher Reed, also starring Ned Beatty, Jackie Cooper, Glenn Ford, Trevor Howard, Marvel Kidder. The film is from 1978 and is directed by Richard Donner. When I saw this rare tape, I decided to get this. And I had no idea this came to existence. A movie that make a legend come to life. Ready PG and it's 144 minutes, which is still in factory seal, which I'm gonna keep it that way. And this is very rare too. I also had this on VHS, DVD, Blu-ray, and LD release. The next tape is also still in factory seal. The 1996 VHS of the Hunt for Red October with Sean Connery and Howard Baldwin, also starring James Earl Jones, Scott Glenn, Sam Neill. The film is from 1990 and is directed by John McIntyre. My God, this movie is turning 30 years old. I also have this on DVD and Blu-ray as well. I also have the original pressing. Rated PG and it's 135 minutes. And it's got two promos of Patriot Games and Clear and Present Danger. Next up, the 1991 VHS of Miracle on 34th Street, the original with Marie O'Hara, John Payne, also starring Edmund Gwynn, Gene Lockhart, and Natalie Wood. The film is from 1947 and is directed by George Seaton. They also have the colorized edition and the 1997 release. 1947, renewed in 1974, not rated, and it's 140, no, 97 minutes, excuse me, 97 minutes. But this has the Playhouse home video logo at the beginning. So, this might split into two parts. The next one I got is a 2001 VHS of there's no business like show business, part of the Marilyn Monroe Diamond Collection with Ethel Merman, Donald Connor, Marilyn Monroe, also starring Mitzi Gaynor. The film is from 1954 and is directed by Walter Lang. The 
1954 film renewed in 1982, not rated, and it's 117 minutes. It says here's 1953 on there. All right. Love collecting factory sealed tape. Next up, the 1991 VHS of It's a Wonderful Life with James Stewart and Donna Reed, also starring Lionel Barrymore, and also has Carl Alfalfa Swiss. The film is from 1946 and is directed by Frank Capra. And this is a Republic Pitchell release. I also have the Good Times copy release. It's a 45th anniversary edition, plus the featurette, not rated, and it's 132 minutes. That's bringing up 160 minutes. Here's the ink label. The print date, November 9th, 1994. This is a reprint, by the way. The next tape, the 1994 VHS of Xanadu with Olivia Newton-John, also starring Gene Kelly and Michael Beck. The film is from 1980 and is directed by Robert Greenwald. And this is Gene Kelly's last film. And unfortunately, the film Xanadu did not do well at the box office. I believe this got some animation sequence by Don Bluth. I'm not so sure, but if anyone knows, let me know. Ready PG and it's one hour and 36 minutes, so that's 96 minutes altogether. Here's the sticker label. Printed on the 21st week of 1994, but it's got the NCA home video copyright with 1986 on there for some bizarre reason. But I'm going to check to see if it, this has the MCA home video or the MCA universal home video logo at the beginning. So I'm going to pin comment on this tape as well. Okay, so I'm going to stop here for a minute. We're going to pick up for part two.